Hey, this is Glendon Cameron with the power of six, increasing your game. Day 11. Things about to get a little interesting. You will need a very open mind to hunt your process 15 to 20 minutes per day. Don't hate the player. Don't hate the game. Learn the rules so you can win. Life is a war. Are you going to win or fold? Now it's like, wait a minute, this is power six. This is about pro this productivity, right? Part of the war is the war with yourself. We are predicated on not being as capable, not being as strong, not being as able and powerful as we are innately. As I talked about in the last session, there's a lot of limiters. So part of finding out where your boundaries are, finding out what you can, what you can't do, what overstresses you, you have to push yourself. So <laughs> we're pushing. Day 11, increasing your game. Push. Today you are putting 24 things on your list. Any 24. The goal is to get as many things done in 24 hours as possible. A thing an hour. Can you dig it? Now I'm like, wait a minute, Glennon, you said this is the power of six. I got the basis of the power of six from Earl Nightingale's Lead to Feel. This was roughly 2000, I believe, that I really started using it. Well, over the years, I have used it and have increased it and I've played around with it because essentially once you get the power of six, you know, six things a day done, you're either going to become really productive or you're going to become bored or you know something's going to happen. And are you going to run into situations where six things are not enough? And it's like, wait a minute, you know, we tend to get locked into things. So I started putting 12 things on my list. And for about two years, I was doing 12 things on my list a day. Then there was sometimes, you know, I was like, let me challenge myself. So I would create all of these stuff. So like if you didn't know when I say my stuff is raggedy right now, I'm pushing myself because my task list is overwhelming. And I'm like hanging on by the skin of my teeth and I'm doing this for a reason. I'm increasing my endurance and my power. As I said before, that first book took me three months. It was only 20,000 words. If I sit down and dedicate myself five days a week, two to three hours, I can write 20,000 words in a week. Something that took me 12 weeks, I can now do in one week. Why is that? Because I pushed myself. Part of the power of six is for you to become efficient, more productive, but also better. Because once you start getting these things accomplished and setting goals and accomplishing goals and setting goals and accomplishing goals, magical stuff is going to start happening in your life. I had a, situa I had a situation and it was somewhat overwhelming. Power six. I put down some goals, put down some strategies, and it took me a week to figure it out. But once I got my strategy down, two resources that I needed popped up. See, this is really, really going to be metaphysical to many of you. But once I got the game plan down, the task down, two resources that I needed popped up out of nowhere. See, this is one of the things. Once you start changing your mindset, once you start saying, yes, I can. Not that campaign statement, but for real, like, yes, I can. You will activate things to benefit you and help you. So the more you accomplish, the more you think, the more stuff you activate. Because it was amazing. I mean, just dropped in my lap because I activated what I wanted. All right, so... With that, day 11, you got a lot of stuff to do. So with that, this is Glendon. I'll see you in the next session and get on it.